good, my friends. I have five more boxes. This is the second side of number six of the 2024 Leaf Lumber. And um, one of the most incredible cards that we have pulled, man. I got to be, I got to say, I was pretty jealous when I saw already pulled that shoeless Joe Jackson bat barrel. That was incredible. So anyway, I got five left for you all. Thanks for filling it up for me this afternoon. Uh, I'll be rolling until we run out of steam, basically, uh, this afternoon in the early evening. And then already we'll fire up at 6 o'clock, starting with our eBay breaks. And this is my man right here from FedEx. Dude, you suck. <laughs> Sorry. That's all right, best character. <laughs> That's all right. I'm just going, you know, I'm just chatting, chatting, chatting. First uh, initial. C and then B-A-M. Okay, thanks. <laughs> you got them right there. All right, perfect, man. All right, thank you. Have a good day. <laughs> all right, all right. Now we're back at it, guys. All right, so five of these. Uh, we got to do the randomizer next, don't we? All right, so let's do this deal. Uh, here's all the teams. Uh, three plus. Three more. All right, so we got six. We're going to click up on all of the 30 teams, mix them up real good. One, two, three, four, five, and six. There was some chatter about how the randomizer seemed to be acting weird. I mean, I believe it's completely random, but I did clear the cachet. So if you were happen to be part of that group where you're like, man, that seems to be. I got the same team twice. I mean, it's possible. It's random. It's super random. Anyway, just for everybody that was thinking there might be something weird going on with the computer, it is, uh, it's been cleared out. It's all cleaned up. I don't think it matters, but anyway, here it is. We're doing two randoms in this one. When a tiered team, we were doing like four randoms. But anyway, three and five, we're going eight clicks on this group here. Vito, you in there? Yeah, you are. Okay, sweet, man. All right, got in. Number eight, uh, number eight. All right, Hunter at one, and uh, Joseph there, there at the number 30. Boom. All right, Joseph Senior name, man, makes me, for some reason I got the Willie Mays, Louis Tiot connection in my brain. Joe, do we get you a, was there, was there a Mays jersey again? I always think, man, about uh, your pops. How's old Raider Bader doing? All right, let's roll this uh, sorted up, man. Go to alphabet, alphabetic by name. All right, so here we go. Paste them up on the screen. Okay with me if you guys do want to trade. I'm going to print this list out. <coughs> For each card, I'll be, if I'm not sure of the team, uh, these. Again, it does not matter what the card, uh, jersey colors are on the card. This is all because it's there's no official checklist that puts these guys with a certain team. And there is no city indicated except on a few of the cards. If there is a city named on it, I think it's like the, the six-piece relics. It'll actually say the city abbreviated. Those will go to the cities uh, with the team affiliated. Otherwise, it's majority of career. Rules the roost. That's why we all learned that Shoeless Joe Jackson actually played uh, longer in Cleveland by a few games. He was White Sox and uh, Indians, well, the Americans, or whatever they called them back then, the Naps, for six seasons each, but more games with the, uh, the local Cleveland here team. Lumber. Number seven. All right, guys. Good luck, man. Always a fun one to open each year. They do it the best, man. More barrels and knobs and, and pieces of lumber in, in for the price point, man. It's incredible. Could you imagine what this would be if it was a licensed Topps product? This stuff would run over a thousand a box with the stuff it con the, the contents in it. I think it'd be better than Diamond Icons. All right, the autograph, I mean, okay, but seriously, I guarantee you if this stuff was licensed, it would be over a grand a box. <clears throat> All right, so let's see if we can get some good values in here.
My favorite card so far out of this, the Nolan Ryan bat auto. We hit two of them with Nolan Ryan pictured. It's like, that's incredible. Back, remember, uh, well, Vito would know, back when Houston was in the National League. Lou, which break? There is no code on tier one, man. I, we, like I said, we are already at market bottoms. We just, we were already given, uh, given, given back. So, tier one, man, we just got them as they are for today. Thank you so much, man. So back when RBI baseball came out, the Astros were an NL team, and the pitchers hit. So Mike Scott and Nolan Ryan, they were hitting, man. I used to play with Houston all the time in RBI, you know. Kevin Bass was like the only guy that could hit a home run. You had Billy Doran. Uh, who was the they had a super, super fast, super fast team? Stole a lot of bases. Wow, that name is amazing, Vito. Brad Lidge played college for Notre Dame when I was at WVU playing baseball in college, man. Lidge was a pretty serious, serious guy, man. Him and Aaron Heilman were on that team. Aaron Heilman was a great pitcher, too, and made it to the big leagues. Oh, man. <laughs> the ace. Boy, I don't know if Joe, I don't think Joe Morgan made it. He was done, wasn't he? I think it was based off of 87. Was it made in 87? Go back and look at the lineup, man. He got sent into by Pujols in Houston. I don't look that one up. Brad Lidge, Albert Pujols. Check YouTube, right? It's on there. <clears throat> All right, you know, I'm going to give myself a good platform here. We'll just get all the cards out so I can be a little more efficient with uh, the break here of the cards. This one always takes a little longer than what you think for only five boxes just because we got to look up names of uh, players. Sometimes. <clears throat> 87 rosters for for uh, the RBI, the for the original RBI by Ten Tenjin. <clears throat> you remember if you played the All Stars, you could just hit bombs with the All Star teams. Eric da Davis was awesome. Yeah, McGuire and Conseco. Yeah, Oakland was loaded. They were good in that era, but, you know, back in 1990, who was better? <laughs> wire to wire, baby. Cincinnati. One thing about lumber, man, we all wish there was, uh, you know, an extra card per box. <laughs> all right. Has anybody seen one of the trade cards surface yet? We haven't hit one here, but we've uh, heard about them. If you see one, you can trade it for any card. Any card for a nice one. All right, guys. There they are. <clears throat> 68s, 97s. I didn't see anybody trying to trade them, so we'll stick with it, guys. And thanks for your patience here. And I, I'm going to get my phone ready on. And, uh, and I'll be right. 
difference. BaseballReference.com, bring it on up. sleeves all right guys game on break on good luck to you all may the boom be with you first one i'm gonna pluck off the top it's one of these commemorative top 100 home run list uh, cards and it's number three of six old duke snyder goes to the dodgers the brooklyn dodgers uh, aka los angeles or L.A., the Dodgers. Cooper, you'll get the first card, man. Duke. Two bat pieces mixed in. <clears throat> Duke Snyder. The Duke. Flatbush. Next is Joe Carter. The 11 of 15. Game used lumber. Joe Carter. This jersey of Joe is reminiscent of his days in Cleveland, actually, but I'm sure he's Toronto. <coughs> Via nose, guys. Majority of career Toronto. So that's going to Jesse. Joe Carter to Jesse. Cleveland, six years for the uh, tribe there. Next, this looks cool. Here it is. Mount Crushmore, one of 25. Aaron Matthews Adcock. And Ronald Acuna, the present day man. How about Hammer and Hank, Eddie Matthews, and Acuna all together? Joe Adcock, I couldn't tell you. Now, Aaron and Matthews and Acuna, they are all connected to the Braves. I just am curious about Joe. But three out of the four, guys, it's over 50% of the card, so this does represent Atlanta. Joe, you got it, man. Joseph, congrats. Let's see, Joe Adcock, Milwaukee Braves. Uh, let's see. Yeah, so 10 years. 10 years for the Braves. So, yeah, all Braves on that one, baby. So, it's all an Atlanta card. Very nice. And the last one is a signature sticks autograph of the Chicken Man. Four or five. Boom. Already got one of my kid serial number matches. That's cool. Wade Boggs, signature sticks. That'll go to the Red Sox. Cooper. Boston. Boston strong on the Bogsy. 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 All right, we go on fishing, and we hooked a trout. Vito, one on the board for you. 35 of 35. Mike Trout Jumbo, man. Love these big old pieces. Big old pieces of bat. Game used lumber. Embedded into that card. Used by Mike. Mama, mama, Mike. That's Vito's. Ooh, short print. Prime lumber piece. And it's Freddy McGriff. Take a bite out of crime. McGruff. McGriff. I love it, man. McGriff. McGruff. Two of five. Now, um, I got to look him up. Freddy McGriff. I always think because all my TBS days, the Atlanta Braves. But check it out. Five years in three different cities, but he had the most games with Atlanta. So, Joseph, that is an Atlanta Braves. What's kind of nice is they, they tend to do pictures of the players with their longest tenured team. So, there he is, McGriff in the Braves hat. So, that's pretty cool hit for Atlanta. Lumber piece. Let's see, it's part of the out. Outside of the bat, maybe the handle that has that much of uh, the curve on it. Oh, here we go. 
one of the Bash Brothers, Hitters Inc., Jose Canseco. Reference Jose earlier. Reggie Jackson is baseball hero, and there he was. He was a, ho a hero for many growing up, and, you know, obviously all the steroids kind of changed their, per their per perception of old Jose. But, man, back in the back in those first few years, he was top of the price guides, man. Tom, congrats on that one. Oakland hits that. Canseco, 26-30. And a signature sticks auto of Mr. Sheffield. So two auto relics in that box number two. And Sheffield's most of his career was, uh, believe it or not, in Florida. He played for Marlin six years. And that will go to Richard Spot. Rich, congrats, man. Six out of 35. Chef of the Beast. The Chefinator. That's the one guy that you love to see when you got that Miami spot in the lumber or other non license. All right, here we go. Leading off the next box is a Braun. 16 to 20. Ryan Braun. I don't believe there's. I don't remember him playing anywhere other than Milwaukee. So I think we got we got Brewers. I mean, does he, uh, does he even play anywhere else? I'm just kind of curious. <coughs> no, good. He was always, always there. So Dennis, 16 to 20, Ryan Braun. Next is a dynamic duo, guys. This one could be a could be a random. We'll see. It's here, number four of nine. In 1980, 41 hit homers by Ben Oglevy and Gorman Thomas hit 38 in 1980. All right, so still, it's majority of career is going to be the rule. Let me see what I can find out about these two guys. Yeah, hey, Joseph. All right, Ben Oglevy. Is this Milwaukee? Yeah, so Milwaukee for him, and I know Gorman spent time in Milwaukee too. Gorman Thomas. Also Milwaukee. That's going to the Brewers. Dennis, staying with you. The Brew Crew. Hit two in a row. Next is one. Oh, this is nice. Oh, my goodness, guys. It's a one of one. Five game use bats. Five game use bats. It's a one of one. I'm showing this card first. It's always good to have justice in the middle of your breaks. Five of seven, David. Justice. Signature sticks. Man, I, I'm going to guess. I don't want to guess. Justice. David. I'm going to say he's probably Atlanta, too. Yep, Atlanta 8. Woo, the Braves. Mr. Solden, go Braves. 5 of 7 on that one. All right, now the very important one of one. Here it is. This is awesome, guys. The late, great Willie Mays. That bat piece stands above the rest. But there's, man, another we lost too early. Kirby Puckett. And then Griffey Jr. Duke Snyder and Stan the Man Musial. Team Legends. Team Mays. Is what they call this. Team Mays. Team Legends. One of one. Mays, Puckett, Griffey, Snyder, and Musial. I'm wondering the connection. Does anybody have any idea? We'll figure out if somebody happens to own three of the five, then they would get to keep the card without a random. But otherwise, we got to randomize it. All right. Goodness gracious, that's beautiful. <clears throat> All right, so the giant spot, Jacob. Uh, the cardinal spot, Dan. The Dodgers spot, Cooper. We are going to have a random for sure. Uh, Ryan has Seattle and the Twins veto. So you guys 
We'll have to sweat out a random here a little bit in, in a little bit. All right. Two more boxes to go. We're going to lead off the next one. Good luck in that one. Man, woo. Brett Butler. I think Butler's Dodgers as well. Six of 40. Could be wrong. I looked him up. It's been a couple of days. Brett Butler. Yep, Dodgers. Spent a lot of time in Cleveland after L.A. Next up is number 70 on the top 100 home run list. Currently, Jim Rice, 15 of 15. There's Boston again. Another another uh, standout player from the uh, RBI game, original RBI game, Jimmy Rice. He was still in there. Mount Crushmore is back. And Mount Crushmore here is Joe Carter, Roberto Alomar, Freddie McGriff, and Carlos Del Got it. 14 of 15. I think three of the four are Toronto Blue Jay majority of careers. I think. I know Carter is. Uh, McGriff would be Braves, but Delgado would be to, uh, to, uh, Toronto. Uh, Alomar, just want to double check him. I do think uh, Robbie Alomar. Also was Toronto majority, yeah, five years there. So boom, 14 to 15, another hit for the Blue Jay spot, Jesse. Mount Crushmore, nice. Oh, man. Tom, that Oakland spot, bringing it with a Ricky. 27 of 30. Signature sticks. And, man, I will tell you, Tom, that's a smudge that I cannot, you, yeah, you just can't. Pretend that's not there. Uh, that Ricky card, man. I would probably see what you could do about this one. I don't have, we don't have experience with uh, replacements with Leaf, but I would guess they're pretty easy to work with, man. Um, I'm going to cut out, I'm going to cut this out. Dang it, man. You want a nice Ricky autograph. Let me just cut a UPC out of this box so I can have it handy in case you might need it. Has anybody done anything with, with Leaf on uh, terms of a replacement that's live? <clears throat> so I'll put this with the card, man. Darn, that's a nice one. Other, otherwise, man, it's a sweet Ricky. Uh, that's your box hit, so it ought, to be, it ought to be a good one. All right, one more box worth. Good luck, everyone. Don Sutton, 13 out of 40 game use of lumber. The pitcher. The pitcher. The Dodger. Cooper, congrats, man. That Dodger spot's been pretty good. Next up, it's a Daryl Evans. Wow. Did not realize that Daryl Evans had that many home runs. 16 of 30, the serial number, but 414. Number 54, it puts him on the list. He had a long career. Daryl Evans played, played 20 years, guys, from 69 to 89. And uh, Atlanta, nine years in Atlanta. Eight with the Giants. So, wow, the brave spot again. All right, next card is a nice one. It's called Baseball's Greatest Hits. It's two of seven. And Baseball's Greatest Hits. Must be some good hitters on here. Ernie Banks. Oh, it's got their their a, a number of number of hits, guys. Banks, Ashburn, and Man Ram in the twenty five hundred range. Over here is Helton, Morgan, and Buddy Bell. All right there in the twenty five hundred plus base hits range. Oh my, probably a random here, probably. Banks, Cubs, Ryan, uh, Ashburn, I think, a Philly, uh, Dan, Man Ram ended up in Boston, Cooper, Helton, Rockies, Cooper, um, let's see, Dennis also on this, Buddy Bell, guys, Buddy Bell, man, what's his majority? Texas by a year. 
Uh, Richard. So yeah, nobody's gonna own four of the four of the six. So we'll go randomizing on that one. Oh my goodness. And one more. One more auto signature sticks featuring another Atlanta Brave, Dale Murphy. Four of twenty-five. Joseph, have yourself. A nice stack of cards, my man. Dale Murphy, 425. There's the Braves on that one, Joseph. It's Atlanta's Murphy. All right. Let's go ahead and determine who gets this card first. I'm going to keep it simple, guys. I'm just going to do a die roll on this one. All right. So we're going to go top. We always do uh, top to bottom, left to right. I got a six sided die. So we'll go uh, one, two, Three, four, five, six. All right, here we go. And the roll come up a four. Four, so one, two, three, four. And uh, the, the, the great Joe Morgan. Uh, so Joe, just so I can have peace of mind on it, I'm gonna look up Joe Morgan, and I'm gonna see, wow, he played 21 years. I'm gonna see Houston. There he is, Joseph again, Houston, 10 years. Ten years. And I always think of him as a red, of course, but that's going to Joseph in that Houston spot. So anyway, that's pretty cool. The greatest hits there. All right, this is the big one. Guys, thank you so much. After this, guys, I'm sorry. I got to run and uh, I got I to gotta take a, a quick pit stop. So we're going to go. I got a ten-sided die. Here, we're going to do it. All right, we're going to use the die roll. Ten-sided die. The zero is the ten. Top to bottom, left to right. So Willie Mays is numbers one and two. Kirby Puckett, 3 and 4. Ken, 5 and 6. 7 and 8. Duke, 9 and 10. Stan Musial would be the winner. Whew. Good luck, everybody. It's a beautiful card. Here we go. Roll that die. And it is a 0. The 10. The far right. Stan the man. Musial. And that team matches with the St. Louis Cardinals. Owned by Mr. Rambo. The last spot mojo. Dan. Welcome back to Ohio, brother, man. Holy cow. One of one. Team Legends. Team Maze. All righty. Oh, man. I know everybody wanted that one who was uh, who had a draw, man. Much appreciate, guys. Leaf Lumber. We'll try to bring it back if we get an opportunity to buy it at a fair price. Guys, you know we'll try. Um, it's tough. It goes. It dries up so fast every year. So, Dan, thank you. Cardinal spot snags it at the end there. All right, let me set this up here. Okay. To recap it, we had a Ricky. No, not a little bit of smudge, so I'm going to keep that card with it. And let's lock into focus. Yeah, Joseph, absolutely, man. Thank you. So there's another one. I need to put a list. Uh, Joe Moore, I need to put this one. Sorry, guys, give me a second. Need to write down Astros. But that is the break. You guys have seen it, man. If you're taking off, keeping the fairway. <clears throat> and I hope you guys are ready for some tier one. I'll, I'm sorry. I've got a. Uh, ever since I lost my gallbladder, man, things are not as fun. <clears throat> I'm just going to show these back real quick. Autograph there, Mr. Justice. That was a Brewers card. Both guys were Brewers, as was Braun, of course. The Marlins hit the Sheffield. Conseco and McGriff, the Lumber Prime. A little Trouty Bat piece in there. Boggs, that was a Braves, Mount Crushmore, Carter, and the Duke. All right, guys, thank you so much.